began coming here in 2016, but you can look back at the history of the four hours of Imola all the way to 1954. So 70 years on, we're about to go racing again for this now traditional four hours of Imola. The World Endurance Championship have revealed or realised the secret of the Imola racetrack as well. That was a tremendous race earlier on in the season elsewhere in the ACO rules ladder. And now there's a drama for the 66 JMW Motorsport Ferrari of John Hartson. It looks like he's not going to be able to make the start. They'll cross the finish line first of all. The start line is around the next right-hand kick, so they're still waiting for those lights to go out, which they do now. And we're racing for the first time, for the third time in the European Le Mans series in 2024. And is the 65 going to be able to lead into that first corner? Manuel Maldonado with his arms full into the Tamburello chicane. But he is able to fend off Ryan Cullen and Lorenzo Fluxer for the first time of asking. The 43 does indeed have to start the race from pit road. So Sebastian Alvarez came down pit lane and will be released very shortly. Lorenzo Fluxer, though, running in third ahead of Matthias Kaiser. But initially, after that great lap yesterday from the 65 and Xiaomi Lacey, his teammate Manuel Maldonado is able to lead in the early stages, Graham Goodwin. Now, the 43 did get off pit lane, so he's at the back of this grid can also confirm that John Hartshorn did get the 66 car running and that is at the back of this field so all 43 cars in the train as we start the first lap of this fabulous similar circuit and already James Allen's making progress he's managed to get by well obviously John Hartshorn because he was stopped but Claudio Schiavone has been cleared by the Australian and uh, the number 30 Duquesne team car should make quick work of many of those GTs. In fact, it's already got by another five or six of them, but threading their way through the Grassini chicane for the first time, the LMP2 race leaders, Manuel Maldonado, half a second back is Ryan Cullen for Vector Sport, and that car was put spectacularly into third position yesterday by Felipe Drugovic, his Brazilian teammate, by far the best Vector Sport starting position of the year. There's James Allen darting to the right-hand side, Hiroshi Hamaguchi in his Lamborghini, the bright green and black car of Iron links, but it's the green and black car of Duquesne which gets the position down into Rivazza, and there was a lead change in LMGT3, Graham. Indeed. Uh, car 43, that late start against Europol car, will have 60 seconds added to its first pit stop. Uh, that's uh, some uh, regulation that will have uh, got the wrong side of in the dramas that befell that car with its technical problem, but we're underway. I think that's as part of a car starting from pit road. It used to be that they could only rejoin after the first racing lap, so automatically you would start the race a lap down.